everybody know what I'm wearing on my head? VR. Using things like VR glasses are helping us expand things like science and space travel. We are here at Cloud 901 at the Memphis Public Library. Today we're celebrating an Hour of Code. The Hour of Code is a campaign by Code.org to get individuals around the world to spend at least one hour of coding in honor of Grace Hopper's birthday. Grace Hopper was one of the great pioneers of computer science. Hour of Code is basically us honoring one of our pioneer women who led a path for coding. Today we've got 70-something kids that are actually engaging in coding activities. These students are actually taking these characters and programming them with a block programming language to dance and make certain moves alongside popular music that they're listening to. They are actually playing their songs and getting their characters to behave alongside the music. I've chosen a couple of songs. I did Thunder by Imagine Dragons a bunch of times and Sorry by Justin Bieber. One, it was Take On Me, YMCA, and then it was the Electron Shuffle, I think, and then the Macarena, and we just kept editing get it made it go super fast. We believe that every child should have access to computer science education. Computational thinking is increasingly important for our students. Unfortunately, our schools are not universally providing it to students. And so the Hour of Code allows us to kind of splash onto the community, raise awareness and build advocacy. Hopefully, we will achieve the success of bringing computer science education to every child in every school and in every grade. Coding is important because I mean, it can get you a job. I like playing games a lot. I like, like seeing how all the stuff looks. With the time frame we're in now, most of the jobs are going to be with coding and making new tech. So it's good that young people are learning how to code. 